Hello everybody, Argolfump here, playing the second half of... Grim Facade, Sinister Obsession. In the previous video, we completed Chapter 4 by investigating Mario. In this video, we're going to investigate his brother Luigi. My sons, I am getting married. What? No. 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 Mamma mia. So this is Luigi. He looks like he's some sort of professor. Uh, professor of African studies, perhaps. And uh, before we explore in Luigi's area, I believe we have to get this. Yes, I know. It, it, it looks strange. It is strange, but that's the puzzle. Okay, and here we need to find a, a bunch of brooches. Because apparently Luigi likes fancy jewelry. Alrighty, three more brooches. I think there's one inside all three of these drawers. Cool, so we have a box brooch, which opens up this box. Hooray, and it gives us a chain extension. And also, this person needs a drumstick. Hooray! Okay, so now that he's been dancing around, we can go inside this area. Bad news, though. We have a hidden objects challenge, and I am not good at hidden objects challenges. Alrighty, so I'm looking for things. I, I don't know what any of these things are. Okay, well, I can open up this. That gives us a hat and a feather. I got that. Ooh, that's a capsule. That's a capsule. Hmm, I'm gonna just use hints here for, for everything else. Okay, there's a hint. That was the mushroom. That is a shaver, and that tiny thing is a screw. Ooh, also I need a brush? Okay, brush right over here. Okay, well that was not as awful as it could have been. Looks like we need something to solve a puzzle here. It's the murderer! The murderer! And that looks like a hand grenade. That That is a hand grenade. We should probably not mess with it. So let's see, I want to go back over here for another hidden objects challenge. This time I'm finding, I'm finding clippers so I can get past those, the uh, nasty hand grenade. I, I'm still missing two clippers? Let me see, where could those clippers be? I guess, there they are. Chain extension goes over here. And there's definitely something inside there, but I, but I can't open it quite yet. Over here we have a puzzle. You want to pour sand into various places. And you have to find the right spot for everything of sand. Alright, that's not too incredibly difficult. That lets us solve this puzzle here. So with the four colors, you want to paint the four parts of the mask. The mask is still wet, so we're going to put a mirror here. over there. Whoa! Oh, no! The murderer's 
stabbed the doggy. Oh, that's awful. That 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 truly is awful. What a monster. Okay, so we have a mask, which means we solved this puzzle. You just want to put everything so the sides match. So, for example, bottom left-hand corner is all red, so we have red piece here and red piece there. And when you have a piece in place, it snaps into place and can no longer be moved. So let me see. I believe I'm almost done with this chapter. I grab the fruit picker. I go all the way back here. I use it in order to get a zipper pull. And I'm going to use the zipper pull over here to get a bandage for the dog. And while I'm here, I've got another hidden objects challenge. <laughs> Let's see, I can get snow. I, I can find some of these items. I found a flower. An elephant. Matches. A thimble. I need four. I need an ant. I need a number 18. I need a griffin. Griffin and a clasp. So overall, I have to say this is not my favorite chapter. I don't like it because the dog got stabbed. Um, the mask thing was kind of strange. I mean, good puzzle don't see how it has to do with an Italian murder mystery. And, yes, too many hidden objects challenges in this puzzle. Yep. Anyway, we have Francesco's room key, and hopefully Francesco's room will be much more exciting than Luigi's.